Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. <laughs> I feel so sing-songy, probably because my throat feels good, because I'm drinking tea. Ooh, I made good tea. <laughs> Anyways, um, I don't know if I did the proper introduction in, like, the last... Um, what was it? The last one, or maybe it was the one before that, but I don't think I said... This right, this what I'm about to say right now. Hi, welcome back to Katie's commentary. As always, I'm Katie, and today, yes, we're doing a. I guess you could call it. Um, yeah. Sorry, that's the. I'm in a different location recording this, and well, there's a thing. A, a what do you call it? I can't even think of. Uh, I guess you can call it a. I don't know what it's called, but it, it's blind type thing and it's like beating up against the window because we have a breeze where we at currently where we at where i'm at um so yes we're doing so it's a uh our special it's called miranda sings live you're welcome using the wrong your but the whole shtick with one of the parts of parts of the shtick with miranda sings is that she's stupid um so I haven't watched really Miranda, Miranda, what? Miranda sings in a while. I actually sometimes forget I'm subscribed to her. Um, it's it's weird because like I feel like who relates to like you you're subscribed to a person and you don't even really watch them anymore. But for some I don't even know. But um, I thought that this character was funny, like pretty funny and fun when I was younger like when I was maybe in high school or maybe younger than that I don't even know um and like I wasn't watching Miranda Sings when she was new if that makes any sense like I think she like what the hell who is this sorry who is this <laughs> I don't know why is I sounded like I was so I'm sorry Um, we have to, I have to update a Google site to, at, wait, what? To, to what? I have to transition it to, I have to upgrade my class. I don't even know what, I only have really like one Google site, I think. And it's pretty new. So anyway, what was I saying? Um, yeah, um, I've seen clips of, like, from the trailer, um, it doesn't look like it's gonna be, like, comedy gold, but then again, there's, like, a thing that, apparently there was a video where, where Colleen Ballinger, who is a K, who also is Miranda Sings, by the way, and sorry for that reveal if you were not ready or didn't know that, but she said she wasn't a comedian, like, doesn't say she's a comedian. But your whole thing relies on is comedy, right? So, the character is, is, yeah. So, she's been doing this show. And from what I can see, she does the same kind of bits. Um, like, she's been touring with this, like, show for a while. And she does the same kind of couple of bits um, in them. So, I'm going to watch it. Um, I guess with an open mind and you know what this is why these tracks are interesting because you can basically be it's gonna be like my track with my tracks are like I react to things that I haven't seen before so it's like raw like unfiltered like the first time I've seen something mixed with like why something's great why something's good you know and everything or I'll be like why the right here's the thing my primary thing that I focus on, or what I focus on primarily, is writing. Because that is your... You are the architect as the writer, pretty much, like, laying out that landscape of, like... Or that foundation. <laughs> That's the word. I can't speak today. And then everything else is built off of that. So... I should probably hit play, right? Okay, we're gonna hit play. Three... Two, one, and this came after um, 
after they canceled her Netflix show. I watched the first season of the Netflix show. That was years ago. And we have to remind ourselves that it's uh, children as the... Uh, We have to remind ourselves that the primary primary audience, target audience, is children. Oh my gosh, she's like having the best day of her life. Oh, and this is when she's pregnant, by the way, with her child. Daydreaming. Ah. Ew. And she's like gross too. Ew. Ooh, I got like, ooh, that's a lot of honey I got in that sip. I thought she was bare feet, foot? Feet, bare foot, bare foot, yeah. Was she at the Kennedy Center? It didn't look um that big from what I saw, but I don't think they showed like a proper like establishing shot. Why? That's gonna be all these pregnancy jokes. Oh my god. Only your whole audience. Actually, like a bunch of comedians, a bunch of female comedians actually say that it's horrible. That's like every parent. <laughs> I I think Everybody says, like, a lot of people are like, all babies are beautiful. No, they're not. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is funny. It looks like they're all her, like, shitting. Because I have pictures of me as a baby where it's obvious that I'm taking a dump, but my parents are taking, like, 50 pictures. You chose to do that for a living. How ugly he is. Oh my god. That's terrifying. Oh my god. <laughs> Why'd you give him like a dumbass frat boy voice? He actually is, he's born, but he's like one over, he's like one and a half, I think. He's actually really cute. He's like really cute. Don't worry. I feel like I, you know, I'm going to get haters, but back off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Um, but um, I feel like Miranda Sings. It's, 
I don't think she's that relevant anymore. I know, you can, whatever. Just my opinion. Oh, we know, honey. There's a lot of growth humor. Dumb. That's like every single like cartoon you grew up watching. You're like, hey. Like, hey, they're talking about sex. Like, later on. Ah. Oh my god. That's why you gave your child headphones. <laughs> then why did they give you the interview? Oh, that's a, whoa. <laughs> you just said it and there are kids here. Thank you. I wonder if anybody agrees with the hate comments that she's going to sing about. It's like I had to be hate tweets. We've already... She repeats things a lot. Thank you. points. What? Does she have cancer? What? What? I was gonna say, <laughs> she's probably gonna be like, yeah, cause she's a cat lady. How can we hear the ukulele that well when it's not mic? Like specifically, well, I guess it's. Oh, a raisin, oh. It's just not... It's catchy, but like, like the marinade joke, like, that's not funny.
It's just like... Don't do that. Oh my God. It's gonna say die. Die. Yeah. People, yeah, search. Buried. <laughs> Could you imagine? Buried. Buried. <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. Thank you. My diary. I've actually seen a couple of these videos and actually there's, she writes things like, you're like, whoa. Like they're actually kind of funny. What's wrong with me? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> she looks like an Amish kid. Marsha. <laughs> Right. I can relate. <laughs> Yee. <laughs> oh, shit. What? Of course you did. I believe it. I was gonna say. <laughs> I was like, I think she was homeschooled, right? Oh my god. Just blunt to the point. She's like a... <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I love that. Don't expect many letters. Good night. That's it. Okay, this is the this is my favorite part.
Oh my god. Ow! Oh my god. <laughs> my boobs are popping out. I like how she has like illustrations. Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> what the hell? He kind of looks like a Ken doll. Prayer journal. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Precious daddy. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> she calls God precious daddy. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the best. I think when she was little, she was like a comedic genius. That's for sure. And she didn't even, was, wasn't even trying, you know? Oh my gosh. Yes. There's more. Good times. Ah, ah. Oh Lord. Amen. Oh my gosh. The poop. Oh my god. The poop diary? Oh my god. Oh my god. This is not the funniest diary so far. Oh my 
my god. It's not a good punchline. It's like... Like, <laughs> dire... No. Where's your poop thing? So far, the best part was like the first two diaries. I think it was. Or the first two diary things. I like how, like, the dramatic, like, <laughs> camera motions. The thing is, she's a very, I think she's a way more talented singer than she is, like, comedian. You know what I'm saying? Which, I know that, like, I'm sorry, the people, the children that love her. I think it is interesting that Miranda was created to kind of, like, let people know that they were stupid. Like, she's making fun of these people. They're like, oh, I can sing so well. Dun, 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 dun. A sweater. Crocs. No, Crocs. Ah, yes, brats. They're like, oh my god. This girl's like, oh my god, I can't believe I just witnessed that. She. <laughs> the boss. But she, like, she thought she saw, like, a transformer. A transformer, like, transform, and it was like, whoa. Oh my god. I don't know, I think I'm discovering that I outgrew. But you know, I don't know. The, I remember watching, I can't remember how many years ago, the first season. I'm like, oh, this is not that bad, like a first show. After she sings, she's like, hi. Oh, 
Oh my god. A brat? Oh my god! What? Why is there- is that a potato? Or a wiener? What is that? Joey Graceff. Oh yeah, I think one of her bits is that like, she's like, Joey Graceff is her boyfriend. I wonder if that was planned. Oh my gosh. What? Why do we keep mentioning the penis? Oh my god. Like, is it, like, it's like, is it for children or is it for adults? Because it's like, it's like both. Like, at one point it's like, oh, it's for kids. It's like, oh, but like, you're... <laughs> I'm just realizing, I'm like, I'm like, I outgrew this a long time ago. But the funniest part was the diary. And you think, oh, it's like, oh yeah, you watch it for Mandy Miranda, but, but, uh, no. That's not funny. Just because you, like, misspell something. Like, it's not... I don't know. It's true. People are probably offended that I, that I just stated my opinion <laughs> on this <laughs> special. Oh, ooh, hmm. Well, but everybody wants to look at a dog's nutsack. I'm sorry, no offense. That's like saying with all, this feels longer than, oh my God, we still have a half an hour. Y'all, I can't do this. Y'all, <laughs> this might be the first time in history of this channel that I just shut something off halfway through. The best part was the diary parts. Like, she could build an act on, like, being homeschooled. Like, a whole, like, stand-up thing. <sighs> or, uh, with all due respect, fuck you. Kind of, yeah. You know.
It's just like here's the thing. She has like I, I'm familiar with like her like shticks and her 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 jokes of like of like I don't like porn. Like if anything's like remotely like sexual, I don't do porn. And then it's like Oh no. Oh no. It's just like we this the same jokes in this a part of this shtick is not it's not working. It's like for so long when you do it with for so long you're just kind of like okay, we get it. You know what I mean? Oh no. Is this gonna be like really gross? It's a nice knife. <laughs> it's a nice. Oh God, y'all! I I'm seriously considering just shutting it off. I'm bored, which I don't I don't want to say, but I'm bored. It's just a shame when like when like comedians do open mics and they like have way more clever and funny jokes and this makes a lot of money and they get their own special and like those comedians are very funny at open mics and are struggling they're like they're way funnier and construct jokes and everything I think I just, am I bleeding? What the hell? I'm bleeding. A severe case. This is just, I, I'm sorry. I'm, <laughs> I wish I was like watching it and I was wrong. Cause I like, Pray for me. It's just, I don't know, like sometimes a character can only last for so long before it gets, it's just dead. Porny. Pray for them. Pray for them. I'm just wor- I'm worried <laughs> for a mom. I like, do I tough it out or do I just go on about my day? Most common. Oh. I know you children. There was dry humping at my prom. I think I've already mentioned that. <laughs> oh, God. Like, there's moments where you're like, where you're like, she doesn't know, like, what her audience is. Like, she mixes it. And then other times you're just like, this is clearly for children. This is just like, I think this is a, a video. 
She just doesn't live. I guess, I guess if there's, so, my question, for some, if somebody's listening to me, and they enjoy this, please tell me why, and don't just be like, oh, because it's fun, like, you know, I want, I want details, um, I really, I just, I'm curious. And also, it's like, I I think that the origins of the character is, um, is, is really cool because it's like, it's, it's basically making fun of idiots online that think they're like really talented and like, oh my God, I sing so good. It's like, no, you're a fucking idiot and you, you're shit. And they think, you know, they have that gigantic ego I think the origin, you know, of it is very, is very, um, smart. And now it's just like, oh my God, she knew every word. Like, I think, I give her credit for that. It's like the origin of the character, very smart. It's like, sh- it's like you're playing an idiot to let, to make fun of idiots, to tell idiots that they're stu- they're, they're idiots. You guys. Aw. I do like his character in the show. Aw, I do like Patrick. I think Patrick was the best character in the, the, the show. The weirdest, op- weirdest popsicle I've ever seen. Oh my god. Oh my god. And it's Netflix producing it. That's okay, that's clever. But. Ah! It's like foam, it's not even ice cream. Ha! <laughs> it just plops right there. Okay, I'll give it, like, this bit, and that's it, yeah. Subscribers. This may be the first time I just shut it off, (laughs) and I'm like, I can't do it. Uh... 
Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I don't think he's there, but okay. I love the knees. Okay. I'm sorry for not speaking a lot. I'm just bored. Sorry. I'm bored. <laughs> Whatever. Good talk. Bayonne. What? Again? Okay. He's cute. Men boys. Oh my god. <laughs> he shrugs. Promising. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna hit, okay, I'm pausing it, pausing it. There's 17, I know there's 17 minutes, but I like, I honestly, I'm so, this will be the first time in history where I shut something off. Um, <laughs> wow. Um, yeah. I just couldn't. I, um, I've never, I mean, I feel like if I was to give notes, I would, I would you know, continue giving notes and, you know, continue watching it. It'd be the same, th it'd be like the same thing. It's just like, it's not, um, it's just like, we get it. She's an idiot and we get it. Like, and I don't, I'm not really a fan of the songs. Like, I don't know if it's just, I don't know. I'm not a fan of her original songs where she's, you know, being funny. Like, where's my face at? Da, 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 da. Um, yeah. Um, if you like Miranda Sings, that's cool. If you like Colleen Bell, you know, like, I think Colleen, ba Colleen ba Ballinger is very talented. But I don't think... 
comedy is her strong suit, but I could have I could have sworn at one point she's even said she's not a comedian and she doesn't call herself one. So I'm kind of just like, but you're in comedy. So that's weird. I mean, I know that there's a difference between being a comedic actor and being a comedian because that's Lucille Ball. Lucille Ball, which, happy birthday, by the way, we love her, was a comedic actor, meaning she was portraying a character who was funny, obviously, and quirky. She was playing, you know, like, obviously, she played Lucy Ricardo for years. And she even said, she's like, my daughter's funny. I ha-, And she was married to, I think, who is his name? I think his name is, like, Gary something. She's married to Gary. I think it was Gary. <laughs> a fake fan, if you don't know. Um, she was married to a comedian, um, and he also, I think, hosted, like, game shows. And, um, she's like, my husband's funny, and she's like, but I'm not. She's like, I just took, I know how to take direction, which is very true. Like, she knew how to take, I I thought she was a very smart, lovely woman, like, you know, whenever she's interviewed, it's like, okay, she's like this smart businesswoman. Like, you weren't gonna get Lucy Ricardo, who's, like, very quirky, but, like, is, like, a mastermind or whatever, of, like, you know, her plans and everything. I thought Lucy, you know, like, you knew you were gonna get Lucille Ball, who is just, like, very smart businesswoman, um, great actor, um, lovely woman, and, um, there is a, there is a difference, you know, it's like, it's like, I think, yeah, Lucille was a great comedic actor. She's playing a character. She, she there was the the scripts were written by other people. She wasn't like writing it and like performing it. So I get that. Like, there's a difference between being a good comedic actor and a good comedian. Some people are both. Some people are like, oh, I'm playing a character who happens to be funny, but I'm also really funny as like a stand up comedian. But like, your whole brand is based off of like you don't just do videos like you you know as a like a comedic actor. You also do. She was doing kind of like a version of stand-up. You also do live shows. So I'm like, are you a comedian or are you not? Like, I think she what she thinks is it's kind of like, oh, I'm a comedian only in the way, um, like, um, she probably thinks I'm a comedian. I'm not really a comedian on the like level of, like, someone who does stand-up comedy and they just stand there and they go, oh. I think... I think the real gold is her upbringing and the fact that she was like a cat lady from the like birth pretty much. Um, I think what's I think some people don't realize what's golden. They just keep going with like, you know, this character became very I used to watch Miranda Sings every now and then. I, I found Miranda Sings, I was like, oh, she's you know, it's interesting, it's funny. And then um I stopped watching. Um I you know, I think it's I think Miranda's like good at a certain age, and then I think you, you, for most people, not for everybody, obviously there's grown men out there that are like, yeah, like, this is fun. Um, it's all in good fun, you know, I'm not against people having fun with a character and enjoying a character, like, hey, she's laughing all the way to the bank, and she, she has this character, I don't even, I mean, she's probably sick of Miranda to some de- degree now, I don't think she wants to be doing Miranda's things for the rest of her life, that's why I'm guessing. Someone even said in a comment section before, um, she doesn't even like Miranda Sings. Um, but who knows if that's true? I haven't really, I don't think I've heard it from her mouth. Um, I don't know if she wants to be putting on, you know, all that lipstick for the rest of her life. Um, she probably wants to do other things, other projects, which, you know, go ahead, go and do it. You know, get her, get her done. Um, I think she's not realizing she has golden material. I mean, in some ways, I think she realizes, like, oh, I was very awkward and quirky, and I was that musical musical theater kid. Um, She does realize that, but I think you should, like, totally make a stand-up show or, like, a a one-woman show around that because that was funny. Like, that was my favorite part where she was, like, talking... She was reading from her diary... Like, even if you were, like, recreating memories from your past, like, from your childhood, that'd be interesting. I think the fact that she was, like, the awkward cat lady um, that was homeschooled and also uh, had, like, a funny prayer book and all that. Like, I could see her doing a very much more interesting and much more relatable and much more funny one-woman show based off of her, like, her childhood and, like, how she was awkward and, like, she, 
was weird and she was so emotional and like, you know, emo, whatever she said. So I actually am kind of glad I did this because, I mean, even though I'm not really a fan of this stuff, I really think that, I mean, I don't doubt she's going to listen to what I'm, I'm saying. I just think her gold, her comedy, what would be gold for her comedy, it, you know, what is the idea that is gold is her, is her childhood. I think she should seriously, um, if she was like one day, even if like one day, if so like if one day she was like, oh, I don't want to do Amanda, I mean, Amanda, Miranda anymore. I think she should seriously just go that route of like, but I want to do live shows and just be like, um, I'm going to do a one woman show about my life. Like do that, you know, because um, that's a goal. I think she should seriously do that. Because she has some interesting, like, stories from, like, her childhood. Like, I can, you, even if you never heard any of them, you're like, okay, this is, you could tell that she has, like, stories from her childhood. How she, like, thought she was, like, this, maybe she thought she was, like, a very serious actress when she was a kid. Um, but, yeah, um, don't be discouraged. Don't be, like, don't be, like, coming for me saying, like, you're stupid. She's, like, one of the funniest people ever. I'm a person that watches... Um, you know, I watch other stand-up comedians. I watch Jim Gaffigan. I watch John Panette. I watch George Carlin. I watch uh, Gabriel Iglesias, you know, or Fluffy, how, how he's known. I watch so many different people. Um, and I've watched comedy of different types. I like comedy that's a bit like, considered edgy. I like dark comedy. I like quirky comedy. I just don't think this is my cup of tea. And this is why the first time in years or yeah the first time actually ever in the history of this channel I did not finish something um and it wasn't because it, it was because it was I was so bored and I was like you know what <laughs> shut it off I watched the Dirty Dancing remake and I didn't shut it off it was because it was so bad it was laughable and I could actually say why it was bad and I could pick apart things and I could laugh at it because of how horrible it was this I just was like roll it, it's kind of almost like this I was just bored most of the time and I was like it's when jo you want the joke like okay the setup okay is okay but the joke isn't punching correctly or it's not as strong and you're like I wish it was stronger um but yeah um if you enjoy this, that's fine. Like, I used to enjoy her, too. It's just, it's not my cup of tea anymore. And I was realizing that. I'm like, okay, this is why I haven't watched her in a while. Because I just kind of got bored. Um, I think her, she seems like she's a, you know, her as a person, you know, it, she seems very sweet. And, like, she, and she's very talented. Like I said, she's a wonderful singer. Like, people would kill to sing like that. It's like, shoot, like, she could sing, like, opera and shit, and she can, she can sing very well. She could probably sing every, any genre. Um, she could play the ukulele very well. She could play instruments, obviously. So, you know, I give credit where credit's due. I think she's, I think the, the origin of the character, genius. Like, what, what inspired you to make the character? Like, that's very, that's awesome. She's talented, like, I will say that, but, yeah, but, yeah, if, if, if you're, you know, I just think that the gold, like, the, the thing that she could be remembered for could be her, like, if she did some comedy show about her past, but I sound like a broken record, so, um, yeah. So that's my, this is all just my opinion, um, and don't freak out, um, I just, I think it was, I had a feeling it would kind of fall a bit flat, because I had already seen trailers, or a trailer for it, but yeah, um, let me guys know what you think, um, I'm, I didn't finish it, but I've been here for probably like an hour, or over an hour now. Um, and I will see you guys in, um, the next commentary track, and I think I will do a television show next, so, bye.